Uh, tour shirts are preferable with, with the name of your city on the back where the band played. Tight, tight blue jeans, the, the black t-shirt, the black leather jacket. The color black is eternal and universal <laughs> with metal. I mean, even if you were, you know, 1985, 1995, 2005, if you wear black, it's, you know, you'll always fit in. Uh, long hair um, and usually white sneakers that were, the jeans were kind of tucked into. And this was kind of our uniform. You could, you could identify us anywhere. We didn't look very intelligent, but we, <laughs> we looked committed to something or should have been committed to something. But the most important of all, and this is the ultimate uh, accessory for a thrash meddler, is the jean jacket with the cutoff sleeves over top of the leather jacket with the patch on the back. Mine was Ride the Lightning, like this, Metallica Ride the Lightning. And then as many buttons as you could fit on the, uh, on the front. So you'd have all your buttons on there. Yeah, the guys were pretty set in what they had to wear to go to a thrash show. I mean, it was like the understood uniform that the guys had to do. But with the girls, I mean, you always have to have a little skin out somewhere. That's key, so that the guys take care of you. you had to wear black, and then you just got to rock out, so you do okay. No girl has a problem in a metal show. She's got about 10 guys that'll fuck anybody exactly. up. Exactly, I have like there. That's right. all them guys. I started listening to it when I was 11 years old, and I just liked it. I loved it from the very beginning, and here I am. You know, the ongoing joke was, you know, what has... Uh, what has uh, uh, 2,000 legs um, and, uh, and, and two breasts, you know, an overkill show in Germany? <laughs> but, it was, but that had changed over the years. And, and sure, there was, there's been plenty of girls who've come to our shows. Smart girls get off on all that testosterone. It's pretty heady stuff to be in the middle of a pit with all that smoke and uh, smell. And sweat. <laughs> Besides having my daughter, it was the best thing that ever happened to me in my life. Knowing these bands, being in that time with all these people was the most fun I ever had. Um, it was just in my heart and soul. That's I it. loved it. And I couldn't explain it any other way. It, it, it attracts all types of people, not just, you know, your typical long hair, muscle bound, you know, you know, cut off t-shirt freak, you know? It's kind of transcended more than just thrash. You know, it, it's funny, you know, you're talking to somebody afterwards and, and one's a college student, one's a high school student, one's a real estate agent, and, uh, you know, uh, in, in, in one case uh, I, I met an attorney, you know, and, but, <laughs> one. <laughs> but it's, uh, it's unique that it has a blend, like all kinds of music, I think. Oh, I'm having a good time. Have a good time all night. 